Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we got another dope video for you guys. So I asked last video what you guys wanted to see and I saw a lot of Mortis in Bravo. Now, I've been kind of restraining on doing this video just because Mortis A is all over YouTube right now, but B, I'm not really an amazing, amazing Mortis in Bravo. I mean, I'm a pretty good offensive Mortis and aggro Mortis, but when it comes to dribbling and doing really cool things, you know, I'm not necessarily that type of Mortis. But anyways, we're gonna give it a shot. We're gonna see what we can do, and I bet I can probably make one or two really, really cool plays. So with that being said, we're just gonna hop into some games and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the first game, and we're gonna be going up against a Crow, a Dinah, and a Tara. So straight off the bat, um, I want to focus that Dinah just because. Obviously, that's what uh, what Mortis counters. We're gonna go right towards him. We have a really aggro position already. He's probably gonna be able to pick up that kill. If not, you know, we're just over here. We're gonna be able to get it. But we're just basically gonna wait for a really big dash. Um, that's basically what's gonna win us the game is that dash going into a very aggro position and maybe even getting some cool dribbles and goals. We're just chilling over here. We're probably going to push right towards this Dyna over here. You don't necessarily have to hit someone with your... Uh, oh, we were able to get out of that. You don't necessarily have to hit someone with your dash. Like you saw, I just got closer to the Dyna over there. That also works. You don't have to hit him necessarily. I didn't think I was going to go down to that. Okay, I feel like I got ticked forever over there. But anyways, we have a pretty good start going on right now. Uh, maybe we have a goal here. I'm not sure. No. Okay, so Keith is almost dead. We got the crow moving up. Fudge cake is going to go down. We're gonna be able to get the bats off and hit three opponents with it. Oh, we hit a box. That's what I mean. I mean, I could be a really good mortis, except I do some plays like that, which don't really make it work out. But we're just gonna be chilling over here, going up the map. Fudge cake did go for the goal, but he's gonna miss. We're gonna get a little bit of a dribble over here, put it into the open net, and that is going to be the first goal for us. So it's looking pretty good so far. We've been on the offense the entire time. We're gonna be able to get two hits over there. And we're gonna be able to take both of them out. That was really, really good. The crow is spinning. He knows it's a game over. We're just gonna dribble to the side over here, put it right into the net. And that is going to end the first game. So that was a really good ending. As I said at the beginning of the video, good aggro mortis, but we're gonna try and get some really cool dribbles, some really cool trick shots. Let's see what we can do. Let's hop into the next game. Okay, so here we go into the next game. And this one isn't gonna be as easy. We're going up against a Jesse, Anita, and a Shelly, which all three of those do fairly well against the Mortis. So we definitely have to stay away from the Shelly, most importantly. Let's see what we can do here. We're going to try and go over here and pick up that ball. Again, though, we can't do much. They block us off really, really well, so hopefully our teammates can make some good plays. Oh, no, the Band-Aid got us. I don't think there's much Fudge Kid can do. They're going to be able to pick up the kills. And that's going to give them a very, very quick first goal. So we're going to try and play this one a little bit differently. Maybe go towards the Jesse instead. Uh, we're going to go into this grass. See what we got here. Fudge Cake's going to try and go up. I got to stay away from that Shelly. Although Fudge Cake does look like he's going to go down. We're going to be able to get a kill on that Nita. Uh, we're going to just take out the bear, I guess, over here. The ball is in the corner. Odds are the okay. Yeah, I was just about to say the Shelly probably has Band-Aid, and she used it just as I was about to say that. Oh no, no way that hit us. We're gonna be able to get one hit with the bats there, not enough for a kill. The Shelly's moving up. Oh, she almost got that shot off. They have a really, really good counter to our comp. This is gonna be really, really difficult for us to win. Really good kill over there though. I'm gonna have to play aggro here because I can't do much with this Shelly around. He's gonna go up here, gonna get, oh my god. That was one shot, okay, that's fine. We did a lot of damage over there. Keith was able to clean it up. He got the last shot on the Shelly, the last shot on the Nita, and that's gonna give us a one-to-one -one tie. So it wasn't looking very good, but we were able actually to get back into it a little bit. So let's see what we can do. The Shelly is gonna pick up the ball. We're gonna go right into the Shelly. She's probably not expecting it. We're going to use our bats, get a couple hits, but it's not going to be good enough to get any kills. Keith's got to get that kill over there. He's going to be able to do so. Jesse's going to pick up the ball and is probably going to get a shot attempt. Okay, she's going to back off, which is really, really good. We're going to be able to take out that bear. And I'm just going to push up over here. Got a few shots off, so we're one shot from super. Again, this isn't looking very good, and once it hits overtime, it's going to be even better for them. Uh, the Jesse is really, really good in overtime. 
and that's something that they have and we don't. So it's going to be very difficult. We're going to get some bats off. We're going to be able to take out this Nita, but hopefully that's not it. Oh, she gave us the ball. She was trying to kill us. She gave us the ball. We just put it into the net with two seconds left. Wow. I can't believe they threw that one. The Jesse or the Shelly just wasn't thinking. There was no one there for them to, uh, to stop the goal. Just gave me the ball, and I guess I'm going to put it in. So that was a really, really good intense game. Let's hop into the third one, and let's see what we can do. Okay, so here we go into the next game. And we're going to be facing Tifu the Primo, uh, a Spike, and a Tara. So just off the bat, Spike and Tara are a lot easier for me to kill than the Brawlers that we were facing last game. So this is definitely going to be easier for me. Uh, let's back off over here. Haven't had a chance to get a super dribble though, which is actually pretty interesting. A little bit of a lag spike. I think it's server lag. Uh, we're going to hand the ball off over there. Keith's doing a really good job as well as Fudge Cake at taking out that Primo. We're just going to be able to walk up over here a little bit more server lag. Don't really know what's happening. Okay, we have the ball. Again, the servers have been really weird. I don't know what's up with them. But anyways, we're going to get a quick one to nothing lead. The spike straight away has just decided to go on the other side of the map. We're going to be able to get that kill, and we have our super now, so maybe we can get a good dribble or a nice play going here. I'm just going to walk this way, see what we can do. There isn't a lot of room for us to do anything, unfortunately. Oh no. Oh, I missed the ball. We almost made a good play there. We were close. We were close. We almost had it, but we didn't end up getting it. Primo's going to be walking down. He's going to be able to get the kill on our Shelly, which is not very good. But at this point, all I can really do is charge my super. He's going to walk into the net. And that's going to make it one-to-one. -one. But I do have my super again, so maybe I can make a play. Primo's going a little bit aggro. So we're going to have to go just with an aggro play. We're not going to do anything special with the dribbles. We do have the ball here. Going to take a dribble up. Take that shot on the left, and that is going to give us the third straight win. So we're doing pretty good with the Mortis. We got star player at two out of the three games, which is really, really good for Mortis. We're going to hop into the fourth game. I think we're going to do two more, so we can have five games. We're going to hop into the fourth, and we're going to see if we can go 4-0, and hopefully a perfect 5-0 by the end of the video. Okay, so here we go into our fourth game, and straight off the bat, you can see they have a Shelly, so it's going to be a huge problem for us. The bow also is actually sneaky good against a Mortis, although we are going to be able to take him out really easily. Hopefully we can get that Shelly down. No, she's going to be able to score, so that's a really, really bad start for us. 15 seconds in and they already have a goal. Let's see what we can do here. I'm going to try and basically do the same thing. Kill that bow, we're able to do so. Hopefully our teammates can pick up their end. No. Oh my god, we just lost so fast. Oh my god. The teammates were not doing their job. We did our job. Okay, the teammates were not. Um, but anyways, that doesn't really matter. So we're, we're going to do six games. That was a really bad fourth game. Really fast. Worthless. Let's hop into a game. We're already in it. And let's just see. So we're picking it up over here. Uh, what do they have? They have a Colt, BB, and Nita. Okay, so that's not bad. We can work with this. Okay, so we got batted back immediately. Looks like this Nita is AFK, so we're just going to target this Colt. Going to be able to pick up that kill. Hopefully the Nita comes to life. Much Cake's going to be past the ball. Okay, there we go. We got the Nita in. We're just going to go forward. We're going to get a couple hits over there. Going to be able to get one shot on the Nita. Oh, oh, she was like three quarters through her swing. We got super, super, super lucky with that one. That's going to be the one to nothing lead for us 30 seconds into the game. Nita's going aggro. It might be a bot, but I'm not sure. Gonna be able to get that kill. The Nita was very close to scoring. I'm just gonna pick up this ball. Oh, I guess Keith is gonna take it. We're gonna try and stay alive there. We're gonna be able to do so. We're behind them. Fudge Geek's gonna try and get that pass off. He's not gonna be able to. The Colt's spinning. He knows it's basically a GG. We're gonna be able to get two kills, and that's gonna end the, what was that? I think that was the fifth game. Yeah, so we're going to do one final game. Hopefully we can get the dub. Um, yeah, let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the last game. And Rosa, Jesse, and Shelly. That is not a good comp for us to face. Let's see what we can do. This one's going to be super, super difficult for us. We're basically just going to have to target this Jesse all game. But even so, the Shelly is going to be right beside it. There's not a lot of separation on this map. So it's going to be a little bit difficult Rose is going to try and score. We're going to be able to get that save. Although we cleared it like right in front of our net. Okay, we're able to get that kill. 
Gonna use our bats over there, and we're just gonna try and take off on this side. Unfortunately though, the Shelly is gonna spawn, so we're not gonna be able to get that goal. Okay, we gotta run. I'm gonna push the ball up. Shelly is getting hit pretty badly by that Nita. And go right onto this Jesse over here. Hopefully we can get two shots. There we go. We can get two bats off as well and just kind of get out of there. Fudge Cake is going to be on that Rosa. He's destroying it. Um, I think we're able to pick up the kill. We are. And we're just going to put that one into the net. And that is going to be the one to nothing lead. So again, I don't know how we're able to do. Uh, we're not doing that well, but we're still able to hold our own so far. Oh, I missed my bats. That's brutal. We can't miss the bats. The bats are so important when you use the star power. So that's uh, that's a deserved death. That was a death because of us. Um, this Rosa is going to be doing a lot over here. I'm going to try and get it away of the Rosa. Um, no, he's going to be able to score. Nothing I could have done there. So it's going to be a one-to-one -one tie with one minute left. Again, we're going to be on the side of the Jesse. We're going to be able to get two hits there. We're going to get two hits with our bats as well. More hits with our bats. We're just out here dominating. Nothing that their Shelly can do. We're going to be able to pick up the kill. That's going to be the triple. We're going to pick up the ball, put it in the net, and that is going to end the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. We dominated with Mortis today. Um, if you guys want to see some more Mortis gameplay, Coiled Snake is by far, I mean by far, the most fun star power. So definitely let me know if you guys want to see like kind of a Mortis guy, because then I'd bring on some pro Mortises like patchy or like second best and just get them on the channel and just get some really really cool gameplay show you guys what to do and what not to do so if you guys want to see that let me know but anyways that's going to be it for the video thank you guys for watching and i will be back tomorrow peace